Hello everyone and welcome to my Sister Wives For You channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Cody Brown is being open and honest about his relationships and family. The Sister Wives actor opened up about his sentiments for his wife Robin and the rest of their family during a recent Q&A with TLC's producers. Robin, Christine, Janelle, Mary, and Cody all played a word association game. When TLC gave each cast member a word or phrase, they were invited to convey what immediately came to mind. Time for a little word association with the hashtag SisterWives was the description for a humorous reel posted to TLC's Instagram page. Sunday, September 15th at 10 9C is when the new season debuts. Cody talked candidly about his marriage to Robin when he answered a question regarding wedlock. When the word marriage appeared on the screen, Cody's response seemed to imply that his relationship with Robin was all he had been hoping for. Now, the origin of all happiness, Cody smiled and admitted. Cody's arrogant response seemed to suggest that, although he had finally achieved his goals in a monogamous marriage with Robin, he wasn't content in his polygamous marriage. Cody used to support several marriages. In reality, love should be multiplied, not divided, was his catchphrase at the start of previous Sister Wives programs. However, it's obvious that both he and practically everyone else now have completely different opinions about polygamy. Robin expressed during Sister Spouses Season 18 that she was still looking forward to spending her golden years with her sister spouses. However, Mary dashed that hope when she said that, after 33 years, she was finally divorcing Cody. Mary was the third of Cody's wives to eject him, following in the footsteps of Janelle and Christine. The father of 18, Cody was married to four women when he was first introduced to Sister Wives viewers. However, things that happened in the last 14 years tore apart their big polygamous family. Since then, Janelle is relishing her newfound freedom from marriage, Mary is back on the dating scene and seeking her king, and Christine has wedded David Woolley. Cody also talked about his family ties, which, as the TLC star freely admits, are both a blessing and a curse. Following the appearance of the word family on the screen, Cody explained what he associated with it. The origin of all happiness and all suffering, he stated matter-of-factly. When Cody talks about the cause of all pain, he might be alluding to his damaged relationships with some of his children. On Sister Wives in recent seasons, Cody's falling out with his sons Gabriel and Garrison and Janelle's took center stage. Their developing distance was sparked by Cody's COVID-19 regulations. There was friction between Gabriel and Garrison because of their disagreement with their father's stringent regulations. Regretfully, prior to Garrison's tragic passing earlier this year, Cody and Garrison were never reunited. Sister Wives' 19th season will address Garrison's death but it's uncertain if Cody's and his turmoil before it will be included in the narrative. Usually in the middle to end of summer, TLC announces new episodes of Sister Wives. But as of right now, the network hasn't made any further announcements regarding season 19. Is it because Robin Brown's scenes are being hastily reworked by the production to make them seem better? Robin Brown has been portrayed as a villain of the Sister Wives family, along with Cody Brown. Robin has been shown in over 18 seasons to have motivations other than being a member of the polygamous Brown family. Robin wasn't afraid to voice her thoughts throughout season 1 on why her family's demands had to be satisfied. She expressed her worries about her kids, saying they should be accepted in a household that was already overflowing with 13 children. Cody then turned his back on his previous spouses as he continued to invest in his relationship with Robin. As the program progressed, Viewers saw Robin stand up for her role in the family, portray the other women as the victims, and keep Cody away from his kids. Is there therefore a remote possibility that Robin will turn her life around after years of Cody and Robin being dependent on each other at the expense of Mary, Janelle and Christine's relationships? After Garrison Brown passed away, would the TLC series reshoot some of the taped moments to make Robin and Cody appear less self-serving? Robin and Cody have emerged as sister wives' main antagonists. It's unclear, nevertheless, if this family tragedy will cause the pair to become less disobedient toward other Brown family members. Robin and Cody don't think they've done anything wrong. Therefore, it seems unlikely that they would change their ways. Those who think it's almost impossible for Robin to have a redemption story concur with this point of view. Fans of Sister Wives speculated about Robin Brown, 
maybe having a redemption storyline in season 19 of the TLC show in a Reddit thread. Some think it's possible to change how people see her going forward, while others think it's too late for the show's audience to heal the hurt caused by Cody and Robin. My grandmother would say that's like putting lipstick on a pig. One reader commented, I don't think there is much you can do to make her more likable. She would have to take accountability for what she did to those women and those kids, a second fan said. Not just the OG 13, but all of the children, including her own. She would need to apologize profusely and sincerely for everything. A third audience member said, I don't think she could ever redeem herself. A fourth Sister Wives fan concluded, I believe there is no chance to save her. Robin's biggest issue is that she deceives herself into believing she is doing nothing wrong. That Cody wasn't content in his previous relationships, and that it is not her fault. When Sister Wives first premiered, viewers were presented to the program as a polygamist household. For wives, numerous shared offspring, one man, and a goal to legitimize polygamy. But with the 18 seasons that have passed since the show's premiere, Sister Wives has come to focus more on the breakdown of the family and a tragedy that no parent should ever experience. Early in 2024, Garrison, the son of Cody and Janelle, committed himself, further splintering the already fractured family. So where does Sister Women go from here, with four women living in different locations? a husband who was once polygamous, but is now monogamous, and an impending catastrophe that hasn't been discussed on the show. Could TLC reschedule or perhaps change the previously recorded sequences to handle Garrison's passing tactfully? Alternatively, will the program stick to the range of plots that lead up to Garrison's demise? And maybe wait to talk about the incident until the following season? Fans can only conjecture as to what will happen next in the series, until its most recent teaser trailer is released. Robin Brown didn't want the prize that Sister Wives star Cody Brown has become. What is meant by that? Robin Brown put a lot of effort into becoming head wife, and she is now Cody's lone spouse after his earlier polygamous partnerships failed. Was the final outcome what she had intended? Robin Brown was the newest wife in the Brown family when she initially joined the Sister Wives community. When Robin joined the clan in 2010, Cody had previously been married to Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown. Nevertheless, Robin was legally married to Cody Brown in less than four years. Mary, to whom Cody had been married for more than 20 years, was replaced by her. Their union was portrayed in the series as being temporary in order to save Robin's children from a previous marriage in the event that something were to happen to her. But as the seasons passed, the move looked more sinister, and the couple became more exclusive which hurt Cody's previous wives. Robin was given status in their religious society as Cody's primary wife. She also turned into the one female Cody really paid attention to. But as one woman after another left Cody, Christine first, then Janelle, Mary, and so on, Robin found herself abruptly left on her own with a depressed and gloomy husband. Playing the submissive and faithful wife suddenly lost its impact compared to the earlier times when the women were vying for Cody's attention. Robin Brown put him on a pedestal, and Cody Brown loved it. She was perfect in the part of the submissive wife. Cody used her to set an example for his other spouses because of her actions. Cody asked them to be more like Robin in numerous ways so he could win their favor. The other spouses were growing more self-reliant, so he praised Robin for letting him run their home. Robin consequently gave the impression that she depended on Cody to elevate her above the other wives. She lavished him with attention and catered to him, and most importantly, she didn't appear to stress him out. She had an advantage over the other women because to all of her deeds. But now that she's the lone wife, Cody is completely focused on her. Was that really what she wanted? Or did she like living a multiple lifestyle in order to play the marriage game and win? Either way, now that the game is over, she's stuck in the marriage with no way out and her union is being used as a prop by a television show to maintain Cody's reputation. There is a hypothesis on Reddit that Robin Brown played the polygamy game to win, and some Sister Wives fans commented on it. Did she, however, get the reward she believed she deserved? One user commented, Robin looks so miserable all the time. To have her lover all to herself, she schemed, taught, and even told lies. It wasn't, in my opinion, a huge scheme that she deliberately carried out over time. Simply put, she is too uninteresting for such extensive planning. She wanted to be the fun wife, the easygoing, stress-free, young, pretty wife, 
wrote a second spectator. And for a while she was. Then the OG3 eventually moved on, and she ceased to be the vacation that Cody could take away from the family. Now that she is the lone wife, she must cope with him in all of his majesty. Another fan said. She loved being the favorite wife. She profited from the OG3 tournament. She isn't the favorite anymore. All she is is the wife. No more rivalry, no more comparing, no more making Cody feel so much better than the other wives in her home. Nope, it's the same old thing every day of the week. Janelle Brown and sister wives actor Cody Brown called their quits on their marriage about a year ago. She doesn't seem to be regretting her decision at all, I venture. People come into your life, as they say, for a reason, a season, or a lifetime. Fortunately, Janelle's ordeal with the polygamous patriarch was limited to a single season. Over time, fans saw their relationship deteriorate as a result of Cody's self-centered behavior and unwillingness to accept responsibility for his actions. Janelle used to have to tread carefully, but these days she doesn't have to answer to Cody and can do whatever she wants. Of the group, Janelle was the most intelligent and rational. She deserves to start this new chapter with total independence and freedom, since she was always too good for Cody. Since Cody left her life, Janelle has seen a lot of changes, the most obvious of which being that she spends a lot more time with her kids. Though the 54-year-old and her kids have always been close, their ongoing conflict with Cody frequently prevented her from attending any significant family gatherings. Janelle, for instance, was seated in the front row during her son Logan Brown's wedding, while Cody and Robin Brown were seated on the bride's side, in the center of the other guests. Janelle has been observed visiting her kids throughout the nation since her divorce. Between North Carolina, Las Vegas, and back to Arizona, she logs a lot of miles. Since Cody hasn't made any progress with his kids, Janelle has more opportunities to spend quality time with them. People interviewed Janelle once and she said, Life is simpler because I knew that Cody would come because he was very good about sticking to his schedule, but it felt like a burden because there wasn't much emotional connection and my routine was appended. It must be a breath of fresh air for Janelle to no longer have to consider Cody's desires and prioritize her own needs after 25 years of receiving orders. And now I go to bed when I want, I eat what I want for dinner, quipped Janelle. Now that she is a single woman, Janelle's life revolves around her basic need to be free to do whatever she feels like doing at the moment. She has indicated that she would like a life partner, even if she isn't ready to get back into a relationship. However, since Cody's love for Robin has kept her alone for so long, I don't think she should hurry into anything because she is doing fine on her own. Janelle concurred, saying, I think that would have been a very different story if Cody and I had been different and really connected. Still I feel so much more liberated now. I used to be rather independent and free but not anymore. Janelle believes she can do anything she wants now that she is not subject to Cody's oppression. Whether it is going on a trip, lounging around on a Sunday, or spending time with her closest friend Christine Brown. It was evident that Cody was unhappy that Janelle continued to want a friendship after Christine left the multiple family since he frequently put pressure on his second wife to select him. There is just victory for Janelle now. There is no more choice. Naturally, Janelle is having big dreams now that she is free of a 220 pounds man-child holding her down. I feel like I can choose now, Janelle said. My youngest has earned a high school diploma. I wish to explore this aspect of my life because I have a fulfilling career right now, as well as a large family and grandchildren. But it's a well-worn story that people like Janelle expect their significant other to make wise decisions on their behalf when they are incapable of doing so. At least now though Janelle can alter her fairy tale. Sister Wives fans are eagerly awaiting the release of season 19, and the most recent teaser from TLC has revealed Robin Brown's honest admission of a big error. In an honest moment of introspection, Robin acknowledged that she had made a grave mistake in judgment. The teaser also alluded to growing hostilities between Cody Brown and his lone surviving wife. Fans of TLC's sister wives have long conjectured that Robin, the family's last wife, might have been secretly hoping the other wives would go. Viewers concluded that Robin's actions were a calculated attempt to win Cody's favor because of her frequent emotional outbursts which appeared to be the catalyst for his frequent arguments with his prior spouses. Christine Brown and Cody's marriage dissolved in season 17, and Janelle Brown left in season 18. At the conclusion of that season, Mary Brown made the decision to go away from her family as well. 
The season 19 teaser now features Christine starting a new and exciting chapter in her life, which includes a developing romance with David Woolley. Unfazed by Cody's optimistic ideas, Janelle Brown is getting ready to file a lawsuit regarding the Coyote Pass property. In addition, Cody and Robin have a heated confrontation when Mary Brown forcefully rejects his advances. A really poignant moment from the teaser shows Robin alone herself on her favorite bench, devoid of Mary's normal comfort or the animated company of her grandchildren. Robin is left to wonder about their future together in this isolated moment due to Cody's contemptuous demeanor. Fans weren't exactly sympathetic to Robin after she came clean. Reactions ranging from bewildered to downright nasty poured into the YouTube comments area. Rumor has it Robin's been sitting on that bench crying for years and is still there, is one of the highlights. Although the premise of the Brown family's reality TV adventure seemed intriguing at first, it is currently taking unexpected turns. The program has evolved from an engaging family drama to a terrible tale of heartache and regret, with everything from several divorces and family arguments to the devastating death of Cody's son last year. One thing is certain as we prepare for the upcoming season. The Brown family's soap opera is far from finished, and Robin's most recent revelation may only mark the start of even more exciting developments in their turbulent history.